going to be talking about tool management and we're going to see how Walter are showcasing their ability to be flexible, transparent, cost conscious and as a trusted partner handling the total tool cycle. Our promise, your best performance guaranteed. Walter is synonymous with unrivaled expertise in the machining industry. We use this expertise to make your production environment highly efficient and fit for the future. With Walter engineering competence for every stage of your value creation process. We come to your premises to design your processes, both digital and real, together with you. From goods receipt through to goods dispatch, we talk you through with our comprehensive Walter tool management services. Walter Tool Management. Ordering and Purchasing. With Walter Tool Management, our experienced expert staff supports you with inventory planning and monitoring, all directly from your premises. You can start up production right away. Walter Tool Management is based on the automatic tool management system. The entire inventory is captured digitally. When stock falls below a certain level, an order is placed automatically. This means your purchasing department can focus on more important things, and the staff in your production department always have access to the tools they need. It's fast, transparent and efficient. Inventory Management Walter Tool Management gives you complete control over your tool warehouse. This ensures that tools are supplied on time and reduces your capital commitment, which in turn optimizes your net current assets. So you can put your money to work rather than having it locked up in storage. This means you benefit from higher liquidity and free up staff capacities that you can put to more effective use. We're flexible too and can manage existing storage systems. Thanks to our data, you always know your exact stock levels, which eliminates the risk of stocks becoming too high or running too low. Tool Presetting and Intralogistics From assembly to testing, Walter Tool Management makes sure that all your tools are preset professionally. We combine decades of experience and technical expertise with the very latest technologies to achieve maximum results. Technological support our experienced application engineers provide you with professional assistance at every stage of the production process, all the while utilizing the possibilities of digitization. Our digital solutions get to the heart of the machines and processes, using data to identify the main cost drivers and show you where untapped potential lies. Reconditioning, Recycling Management We recondition worn-out tools to the best standard possible and introduce them back into the tool cycle so that they can be used for new applications. Tools are recycled in line with environmental regulations once they reach the end of their life cycle. Continuous Optimization We make your costs transparent and predictable. Reduce financial risks while ensuring your productivity. Benefit from our services and thereby optimize your business metrics. In other words, make Walter Tool Management your competitive advantage. 
Joe, also from my side, a very warm welcome to our audience. Yeah, with the tool management services, Walter offers to take over your two lifecycle services. If you're searching for a partner that is reliable and professional in handling those activities, we will do all the necessary activities starting from the demand planning of the tools, so what is needed, when and where in your shop floor, to the procurement of the items and the storage in therefore appropriate systems in your shop floor. On top of that, Walter is also possible to provide you the presetting and measurement of the items so you can get them ready to machine in your machining area and in your machine shop. We're closing this life cycle with the reconditioning of the items in original manufacturer quality or the environmental friendly recycling of the items at the end of their tool life. This whole life cycle is always accompanied by professional technical experts who will make sure that you always have the latest technology in your shop floor and continuously grow your productivity. Walter has two different service offers in the terms of tool management. The classic tool management package that you've just saw, where we take over parts or the entire tool life cycle, or especially for big series or mass productions, the so-called FIPA part offer. Here on top of the classic tool management, you will get also the full technical responsibility by Walter. So you actually pay only for those items that have been in productive use in your shop floor. Every tool management project by Walter is implemented by an experienced professional tool management expert that is responsible to, first of all, do a concept in a very close collaboration with you together. So we both achieve our common target to have robust processes and a sustainable process optimization and to generate cost saving. Our promise. Okay, there, there we have it. Thank you very much to Marcus and all the Walter UK colleagues uh, from Germany throughout today. It's been a massive help, many thanks. Anna, welcome to Walter Live, you well? Yes, I'm very good, thank you. Good, what are the advantages of uh, tool management from uh, your good selves at Walter? Um, basically, um, our customers can benefit from uh, two things. Um, first one is financial benefit, which is probably one of the most important uh, um, benefit uh, these days. Um, because there is loads of pressure on our customers to deliver uh, cost savings or, or to cut the cost. And the second uh, major advantage or major benefits for our customers is as we will uh, um, take care of the tool life cycle, the full tool life cycle and the logistics of it and technical aspect of, of a tooling, our customers can fully focus on their core business, which is on producing components, basically. Mm -hmm. So as this show has moved on, it's quite obvious to the people watching, you're not, certainly you're not just selling cutting tools, you're almost consultants now. Yes, that's true. I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm more like a, um, a project manager that introduced, that, uh, that uh, is an expert in tool management and services, not such on a product. And I introduced those um, uh, projects and I also, um, um, I advise our customers how, uh, in every step of the way when we introduce those projects. Yeah, um, and many businesses, SMEs up to the largest companies in the world, they're, they're starting to get digitization. Yeah. So is demand growing for these services, including tool management? Yes, absolutely, absolutely. Especially now when uh, there is loads of pressure, as I already mentioned, there is loads of pressure on companies to cut the cost. Uh, sometimes, or, or even um, it's, a, it's a growing trend that we can see that um, tool management is a way forward for customers. So, um, when we take care of uh, um, uh, tool life cycle, when we take care of the, uh, some part of this uh, customer business, we guarantee the performance and we guarantee the cost savings. And um, when customers usually look at their processes and optimization of these processes, they very often find out that um, optimizing those processes can take loads of time, loads of resource, and, and it's uh, quite uh, cost, uh, not cost affecting for the customer. So they are very grateful to give this uh, uh, to Walter. Yeah, is there anything that makes your offering different to other uh, manufacturers tooling uh, management services? Yes, so, um, yeah, so um, Walter has come in from a very strong um, engineering and machining background. Um, 
can very so to first we can offer um, a, a customer can ensure that he always have the right tool for their application and uh, logistics side of it which is tool management services guarantee that this tool is always going to be available for the operation mm -hmm. when they need it yeah so for engineers watching this at home where, how does this journey begin do you have to say yes Walter here's everything or can you do it in baby steps and grow with Walter Yes, absolutely. So um, for the very first thing, customer doesn't have to take all in. Obviously, Marcus uh, told us or showed us uh, uh, the full life cycle mm -hmm. um, to managing tools. However, customer doesn't have to take all in. They can take just the bit of it. And um, Walter, um, in fact, we need to make sure that we are very flexible and um, we make sure that um, tool management offer is customized to customer requirement, to customer needs. That's very true because there's very few uh, CNC machinists where their factory is the same as the factory next door. Mm -hmm. Everyone's got different problems, yeah. everyone's got different requirements. Yeah, so I guess true. this is the element of yes. the project management you mentioned. Absolutely. Yeah. yeah. So how does, I use the term onboarding, so mm -hmm. I'm interested to learn more. How do, and, and I'm happy to progress. How does that onboarding, how does that work, that cycle? So how they will be basically asking for the process of introducing yeah. those yeah. Uh, tool management project. So basically, we start process with firstly identifying customer requirements. So we go on a customer side, we send a tool management expert or project manager, if you, you can call it that way, um, that spent day or two with customer, with key stakeholders um, to identify the current processes. Mm -hmm. Then we take that processes and we analyze and we optimize those processes. Then we usually uh, present that uh, uh, processes and the way of future way of working to our customers and this is when we start customer usually have um, uh, details when he would like to change here or, or, or adjust here and this is when the whole journey starts we uh, make sure that we work with customer on those details so we follow the customer demand sure we're running out of time but I've got, I've got two things to mention does it take long to start getting results no and this is the this is the benefit or positive part of a Walter tool management services it doesn't take long for customer to see the benefits of this so we usually at the very start of the project we show customers um, benefit calculator when he can see in which area he will uh, see the improvement and cost benefits and then typically after first two or three months customer can harvest first benefits of a Walter tool management services and after I would say about six months then he can see the full benefit and the final yeah. one for me it, it's, a, it's, a, it's a topic in itself but just a quick one we, we saw a little we saw a little example on that video fee per part yes. can you tell us just a little bit so just to summarize what already Marcus uh, mentioned fee per part is when customer doesn't pay for tools itself customer doesn't t doesn't take the risk of paying different prices for tools customer pay for fixed um, uh, price per component which is agreed prior to the uh, implementation of the project and then for duration of the project the cost is stable for customer so we take the risk Wow, okay, so I've got a question for you, Anna, as well. If you want to grab a drink, by all means, just grab a drink. Oh, okay, thank you. Um, but um, my question is, and this is just kind of on a side note, because we did introduce Dean and we introduced Ian earlier, but Anna, um, how did you get into this industry? As a female in the industry myself, I'm always keen and really excited. We've got Maria in the background as well, who's helping out. So it's really nice to have a company uh, come into the studio, be willing to be interviewed as well, but also have females. So um, for yourself, where, where did you you come from and to with Walter and, and how have you progressed throughout the company yourself? So um, I come from very engineering background. I, I've got engineering degree and I always was within a, a manufacturing automotive company. So I come from automotive background. In fact, I come from a manufacturing background. Oh, wow. um, I was in the Jaguar Land Rover before, now I'm with Walter and I just, I just love it. And being a woman in engineering is um, 
great thing. It's a, uh, it feel, gives me a sense of achievement, but also it gives loads of benefit to women. So <laughs> you probably <laughs> might know that. I like that. I like that yeah. as an answer. Mm -hmm. um, right. Okay. I've got um, a question lined up that's come in. Um, I don't know if Joe, have you finished with your questions yeah. as well? So, okay. My question is, and potentially to, actually, I think this might be to Dean, actually. So we might just have to swap you over if that's all right, just for a few moments. Um, I'm just going to say a big thank you as well. So thank you to Anna for getting involved as well. So, um, uh, thank you for watching uh, the Walter Live UK. If you have any questions, you've literally got the next 20 seconds pretty much to send them in. We've covered everything, but if you want to get in touch uh, with Walter Direct themselves or through the MTD channels, please send those questions in. And, you know, like we've said, and like Ian said, like Dean said, like Anna said, speak to Walter, get them out to you. You know, if you want a, um, to a tool in your workshop so you can have some testing or anything like that, the machine monitoring, monitoring system, speak to them because they are willing to come out to you and you have trials. Right, my question to yourself, Dean, then is, uh, with Sandvik owning uh, Walter and Seco, um, how do the companies in the group work together? And this is from Naresh and Sharma. So basically, in essence, is what he's saying is um, the competition in the industry as well. How's that? Mm, that's good. That's a good it's one. A, right? It's a good <laughs> question. Yeah, well, Thanks for that one, Naresh. Yeah, <laughs> Sandvik, Sandvik own Sam Coleman, Walter and Seco, as you rightly say, uh, we are all competitors in our own right within the group banner. Um, we, we don't necessarily work together on projects. Uh, the competition that we give each other because we've all got our own areas of expertise, but we do come up against each other in certain instances. The competition's good. It's, it drives us to be better and mm. try and stay in front of each other. You know, yeah. It's a constant. It's a constant. I'm not say battle because it's not a. It's not a battleground. No. A fun battle. Yeah, it's a fun battle. <laughs> but I always um, my uh, my personal beliefs on competition is it drives you to get better. You you know you've got the new um, products that you're bringing out and with the testing facilities that's it brings you for, forward. You know there's no wrong in saying a healthy competition is a good thing absolutely not absolutely not there's, yeah. there's the old the old adage running to stand still yeah. if you don't run faster than the other person the other person is going to go go right. past you okay well a massive thank you uh, to anna to ian to dean for joining us and of course to our very own joe uh, for uh, the questions as well so any questions you have uh, whatsoever do send them into ourselves uh, or into uh, dean and ian with their um, emails that are coming across at the bottom so thanks to everybody we wish you um, a very safe journey home and a lovely um, afternoon so thank you very much